They are used to fighting, but not like this. Our state's firefighters are pushing for better compensation and protection following a flare-up of cancer cases within their ranks. He's been fighting fires for close to three decades. But in the past three years, Gino De Bono has had a bigger battle on his hands. I feel really fortunate that I'm still getting up in the morning and putting my clothes on and going to work. In 1992, Gino's clothes came off, starring as Mr July in the first ever Fireman's Calendar. He was labelled a hero in Sydney newspapers for saving people's lives. Today, though, Gino De Bono was out to protect his own colleagues by bearing some painful scars. Diagnosed with brain cancer and undergoing several surgeries, Gino is joining a fight to make workers' compensation easier to obtain for fireys. Studies linking the profession with various cancers, toxic gases, items and substances confronting members on a regular basis. They are exposed to hazardous materials um, you know, 365 days of the year and they should be protected in legislation. The chemicals that are in fires now and fires now have even more chemicals in them than what they used to and unfortunately that's what's causing the cancer. We don't want to wait. The families out there, families of volunteers who have given their time freely uh, to protect the community and they are suffering from cancers that they could be getting medical help for without having to fight tooth and nail to get it. The unions are hoping when Labor presents this draft legislation to state parliament this week, it will receive bipartisan support. The Premier today not committing, but confident she'll find a way forward. Instead of walking out of danger, they walk into it. And uh, that's why my government will make sure we have a response which is befitting what they do and really appreciates the dangers they face every day. Every firefighter I know joined up uh, out of a sense of duty. I think we deserve it. Tim Davies, Nine News.